Hey! hey. What up, y'all? It's Anormia's coming at you a little bit of Boondog, Season 3, Episode 11, Mr. Medical. Mr. Hey. Medical. And names. Rana. Serge. Pat. Nubby. Spidey. Marqueta. Chris. Mickey. Not a market substitute. Support the official release. Check out our Patreon. It's a great way to support us. You can get early access on all of our shows as well as uncut watch-alongs, and you can participate in... Polls! Shout out to the Polish. Yes. Oh. Bye. Bye. Now to meet Nanny Gil, we want to say we real sorry. What? <laughs> <laughs> How did this happen? Who did this? Which one of you killed the TV? Oh, that's not and good. That is in the time point thing. <laughs> <laughs> you did it, then. That's Believe so this. funny. This isn't, I'm too old for this. I'm sick of having to beat y'all all the damn time. <laughs> oh, okay. We're going to beat each other. <laughs> 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 Granddad, I think you should calm down. My chest hurts. It's a heart attack. Oh, no. No, my stomach hurts. My lip is exploding. No. It's my bad knee. The room is spinning. What? Is, oh, How is it all me. those things? <laughs> this is like so me. We still have to beat each other. <laughs> no, but call 911. The phone's in the TV. <laughs> is it the only phone? Uh, by this time, they should have smartphones, right? It's like what year is this? Smartphone. Obama exists. Nokia with the snake. But they're kids. The yeah. grandfather's not gonna get right. Them Grandpa's now. like, what do I need a cell phone for? Yeah. I mean, occasionally it takes the cutie pie. <laughs> <laughs> cutie pie. Chop, chop, chop. <laughs> this is also me. <laughs> <laughs> Mortality. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you don't get this guy check up at a hospital. No, I, I had to do that once. It was wild. It was so funny. What? I mean, if it's been yeah. 57 For years, no, then I'm sure the nurse well. kept hyping Chris. Come on, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> What I'm most worried about is your stress level. Is this how you normally react to stressful situations? Ah, uh, it's psycho uh, psychosomatic. Life is more stressful than most people. My one grandson is a domestic terrorist, and the other one is a public menace. <laughs> <laughs> well, I believe if you don't get your stress under control, you're gonna kill yourself. Damn. What the fuck? Jesus. Hey, is that? Yeah. What's his name? Magnificent. What's up, old niggas? Yay! Yeah. I'm just kidding, man. I know it ain't Byron because I already look. <laughs> <laughs> man, I'm just fucking with you, old nigga. What you got to eat in this motherfucker? Why you just come in? No, you can't just come in. Uh, like yes, you can. Mm -hmm. Now, this shit right here, nigga, this all the medicine I yep. need. Yeah. What is that? Is that Vita? Nah, nigga, it's weed. That's the same thing as weed. What? <laughs> what? How dare you bring drugs into my house? You can get us all arrested. Weed ain't illegal no more, nigga. Ain't Obama came through and changed all that. Yeah. 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 I knew a guy once who smoked some weed that was laced with angel dust. He came with a angel down dust in his underwear and woke up in a chicken. Smoky! Nigga, that was Friday. <laughs> You call it reference to Friday? Oh yeah. Immediately when he said Angel Dust, I knew. Angel Dust is symbolic. Mm. Nigga, this shit will change your life. Oh, uh, no, I don't trust it. High blood pressure got you down? Ask your doctor if Zortofrenex is right for you. I love the side effects. They always yeah, all right. at the end. Why did it take medicine in the first place? So funny. Stomach That's mild health. breath. Mild death. Heart, heart attack. <laughs> mild death. Rectal, Rectal fungus. fungus. Rectal fungus! Mild discomfort on or in testicles. Plus a side effect known as total scrotal implosion. Total scrotal the side effects are longer than the commercial. Yeah! Not taking that shit. These are tough for next. Total scrotal implosion. You need it, granddad. You need it. Total scrotal implosion. Man, if you're wide public, if you're scared. nice in a park, oh, it's yeah. good. It's a park, hell yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a good way to first experience it. You're doing it right. <laughs> yeah, unless Uncle Rocco shows up. Oh, That's how we. Yay! <laughs> that is beautiful. I hope it wasn't laced with anything. <laughs> right. It feels, That's like. What it feels like he laced it. Cause he don't trip. If you your first time smoking, me, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, everything yeah. does get a little brighter. The first time or so. After this is that. why I was promised the first time I smoked weed. I did not get it. I was disappointed. Oh. <laughs> this is ruined. You probably for us. smoked some indica. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Chris. It might be like sad winter Indiana day. <laughs> Nothing gets brighter than. You smell uh -oh. weed? Yep. You smell that? <laughs> <laughs> it can't be what I think it is. Yeah. 
Breakfast. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Every time I spell the way I do the rock eyebrow raise. Sausage. Did you sausage? Eggs Benedict. Our dude got munchies. Dude, that's not good for your cholesterol. But it's good for you. Or is he just happy now? It's good dopamine rush. He's getting munchies. I think he's just happier. <laughs> <laughs> what is happening? What the fuck? <laughs> He's eating Cheerios. He's enjoying the food the first time. What's up, old nigga? You gotta pick up? I wanted to tell you I smoked that. You know, that joint? Shh. That shit was off the chain, wasn't it? I've anything like this in my life before. Let me just buy some off of you. Or maybe put me in touch with your supplier. Oh, whatever. I don't know, man. He's kind of picky with his clients. <laughs> I mean, in the streets, they call Just him the weed king. Oh, you know damn. But he might fuck with you, you know, because you fucking with me and shit. Yeah. <laughs> His face. Oh, this gonna be? One oh, white god, the trench coat. Why is this so scary? Oh. Hey, you <laughs> Was this your friend Robert? This is exactly what I expected. You want to check me for a while because I'm not wearing one, so it's okay if you do. In you fact, mean, Jody? this may be a bad idea. Yes. Now, are you looking for anything in particular? Jesus. Oh, nice. damn. Kind of high. I just need something to lower my stress. Let's see. Got Bubba Kush, Lavender Kush. Anybody recognize his voice? Not yet. No, no, but I'm. Very curious about these strings. Hey, I got one named after me, nigga. It's good for sitting on the couch all day and not doing shit. <laughs> you know what? Try this. It's called Black Pearl. The Black Pearl. No, who's his boys? It's Mark Hamill. Ah, what? Nice. Luke? <laughs> That's hilarious. Granddad, we need to talk. Of course. What is it, grandson? <laughs> <laughs> it really be acting making you like like this, for real. Come on, man. Don't you like this? No, oh, it's good. I'm talking about them. I went to the doctor and had a wake up call. And I decided I'm not going to sweat the small stuff anymore. I'm the same granddaddy that you know and love. I mean, his stress level's low, so that right. must be good. Yeah, it gives, the, it gives him no more empathy. Yeah. yeah, our granddad don't appreciate nothing. You an imposter. <laughs> <laughs> granddaddy, a hook. Oh. I'm so glad we had this talk. <laughs> If he, was, <laughs> if he was taking the pharmaceutical meds, he'd also be different mm. with the symptoms. You won't be less stressed, though. How about they wouldn't appreciate it either way, the kids. Come on, guys, you know the rules. Robert said no going back home during bongo time. I'm sorry. What is bongo you know, time? I don't know that fake ass granddad yeah, is over the bongos. There, but we gotta find out what's going on. Maybe he's on drugs. Oh, she's right. <laughs> oh, shit. It's the cops. Wait, Riley, wait. What? Uh, oh damn. My God. Why are you naked? Uh, why not? Why not? Yeah, I want to jump naked and smoke weed too. I guess so. I'm with two pair. How they just come in? <laughs> you know, Tom's probably got a key. No! He's got my baby. He's never a, smoking weed again. It's a waste of weed. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. Granddad was smoking weed. <laughs> smoking. Smoking. <laughs> I don't think it's a big deal, really. No, Huey, it's a very big deal. That's why drugs are so dangerous. Oh my God. Weeds and weed and drugs. He's a lawyer. You start playing the bongos really loud, and then you turn all Bobby and Whitney on us. <laughs> I've learned my lesson. I'm never, ever, ever no. gonna smoke weed again. But he was so relaxed. <laughs> oh, he's smoking. Hey, there's Big Bobby. I got something special for you today. Ooh. Ooh. Not at the door, bro. Man. They call it Skywalker. Hey! <laughs> That's so perfect because it's his voice actor. Skywalker OG. <laughs> That's perfect. What are you talking about? What you oh my god, he's floating. <laughs> Is he walking on Sky? The voice actor played Luke Skywalker in Star Wars. I know when you find something you like, you tend to go overboard, so just be very careful. Like I said, he is going to go Bro, no. and he's in the speedway. No. He's in the speedway. The oh, damn it. You can't be in the passenger. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. So, can you tell me why you're driving so slow? He's old. Oh, no reason. Yeah, he old. I guess I just wasn't in that much of a rush. Yeah. I didn't know you can get a speeding ticket for going too slow. Uh, officer uh, Douche. That's Officer Douche. <laughs> His face. <laughs> I'd be laughing too, bro. No, sir, Officer. <laughs> <laughs> douche. douche. <laughs> Why were you driving?
driving so slow in the fast lane? Oh, just having a pleasant drive on a nice <laughs> summer's eve. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> That's hilarious. Summer's <laughs> eve, douche. <laughs> Okay. No. He was charged with suspicion of driving under the influence of marijuana, as well as possession of a mostly smoked marijuana cigarette. How does the defendant plead? I want you to plead guilty. No way. It's just a first offense. Obama fix it up for everybody. Yeah. Obama fix it up for everybody. That's why I voted for Obama. We legalize weed. That's what we need. What happens if he goes to jail? It's just a first offense. Everybody can go to jail. Oh. oh. Your Honor, I would like to plead not guilty on the grounds that Obama legalized weed. <laughs> Did he? Because I, I think I would have heard about that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who told you that? Doug Nipissett. <laughs> Are you sure he's the guy to listen to about legal matters? <laughs> what does your lawyer say? He's pretty smart. I said, uh, no, Your Honor. <laughs> but Doug Nipissett sounded pretty sure. <laughs> Well, he's pretty sure, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm also pretty no! sure. No! <laughs> you can look it up if you want, no big deal. Yes, please. I like the best <laughs> No, no, sorry about that, man. Look at this. Wikipedia says weed is still illegal. <laughs> <laughs> he went Wikipedia. to Wikipedia. <laughs> it says here that several states have legalized medicinal cannabis. See? Unfortunately, this state ain't one of them. Hey. So, you know. oh. What state are they in again? Oh. Move to California. Oh. Robert, I can't believe how lucky you are. Lucky? How is this lucky? I finally found a thing in life that makes me happy, and now they're gonna take it away from me. No. Dude, just so smoke quietly. Marijuana can be very psychologically addictive. Man, fuck them studies. <laughs> <laughs> I believe all the terrible things you told me about weed, and it was all a lie. And now you mean to tell me I could have had this the whole time? <laughs> Who knows how different my life would be? I might be a Nobel Peace Prize winner, or eight-time gold medal swimmer, or even president of the United States. Nice. Not all of them. Yeah, all of them. Mm -hmm. Telling you the regular meat is completely unacceptable. Oh. I don't even like the regular meat. No one does. Yeah, he's got a point there. I don't even like the meat. <laughs> Look, Robert. I get it. Everybody wants to escape from their problems, but there's a legal way to do it. Oh, what is that? No. 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 So bad. Who is I think you need booze. Expensive, horrible for your liver. The next day is fucked. Your whole day is Look, gone. Look, they're angry. The next day. Ass. You're more I'm mad. Your ass. Oh, no, I don't yeah. think so. I will whip your ass with ruckus's ass. I will whip your ass with ruckus's ass. <laughs> this is me. I think my throat. Yeah, this is runner. See, this is not, yeah. when people say just drink and I, don't smoke. This is the shit. Yeah, like, it's horrible. Hey. I've had a friend do that. There's so many better options. Oh, it's the oh, no, Skywalker dude. Oh, no. <laughs> No. No. That's a lot. I'm literally misty. The guy died by. I'm not going to let them get away with this. And I say they fight back. It's time for civil disobedience. Man, yeah. you do what you want. I'm going to go back to work and cry. Uh-oh. Oh, I'll show you. Nice. Grant? <laughs> that's, that's His name is Grant? Right <laughs> Free my drug dealer. <laughs> what happened to you, Huey? I thought you believed in the revolution. I thought you were a freedom fighter. You're not going to end prohibition by getting arrested. Well, what if me and Rosa Parks had said that on that bus in my what? Oh, yeah, he was there. What if me and Nelson Mandela said that on the bus? Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, he's a thousand. <laughs> yeah. Nelson Mandela is not that. Blood and a crib, okay. <laughs> if it's really that important to you, Maybe we should just move yeah. yeah. Then I'm gonna start in my own movie about the first nigga to be both the blood and the well, crack. Really? He has a high expectation. <laughs> then I'm gonna run up on a Fresh Prince kid and show him who the real is. <laughs> 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 so what's they ain't even paid. We, we. <laughs> Damn. Man, he didn't even think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Wall Street, stop in traffic, how dare you, to protest? No! Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's he's not. Oh, he's out! Grant is out! Robert? But I thought you were in jail. Yeah, I posted bail. What are you doing? <laughs> well, I got six months probation. He's right, he's of course he's He's not worth my free. What are you doing out here? Oh, that's quick. Uh, I'm placing you under arrest for disturbing hey, the peace and Hey, wait, the officer. Come on. You don't understand. I changed my mind. Get all that stuff I said. I'll take it back. Go over. I'm a Republican Democrat. I'm a Republican Democrat. <laughs> <laughs> I am so bummed. <laughs> <laughs> the coolest judge ever. I, I No, I love that judge. This is silly. I'm an old man. I fought for my country. I've earned the right to smoke weed. Yeah. <laughs> 
admit that I probably went too far. Mood Cali. So I guess maybe I am guilty. Granddad, stop snitching. <laughs> <laughs> I decided if you let me go, I'm going to move to California hey. and I have to be in compliance with the law. What? All right. Really, Granddad? Yeah, yeah. I wanted it to be a surprise. <laughs> okay, Mr. Freeman, you got yourself a deal. I'll agree to no jail time, and you are free to go to California. Yeah. Damn, that's what's up. But they're gonna move with three weeks of house arrest, followed by two years probation with mandatory drug what? testing, and then we'll throw in some community service just for fun. That's all we done when he lives. <laughs> oh. Hi, my name is Robert <laughs> Freeman. Recently, I started smoking pot. Marijuana didn't make me happier. It didn't make me cool. It didn't do anything except almost cost me my family and my freedom. You want to be like me, a loser? Ne go ahead and smoke. Old users are chronic losers. Granddad, you make weed look so uncool. I don't think I'm ever gonna smoke. Aww. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go take Why is it over the pants? The block, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> 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 He's such an asshole. For what it's worth, it's not too terrible having the old granddad back. Yeah, well, it's worth nothing, but thank you. <laughs> it's worth nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it's worth nothing. Aww. That was oh, great. Man. man. <laughs> but weed is amazing. Just give granddad his weed, man. Hey, so who was the Nobel Prize winner who smoked weed? Well, I don't know. Google it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, so I wasn't sure. I mean, I'm not gonna Google it. That's gonna be everybody. Uh, <laughs> it's gonna be everybody. Yeah, <laughs> but I just it was interesting because like I mean, we knew who the lump, who the swimmer was and who right. the other person. So I was like, maybe it's a well known yeah. Nobel Prize winner. This episode proved that weed is good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, to this day, I don't understand why alcohol is legal and weed isn't. Yeah, yeah. I don't understand. It yeah. makes no alcohol sense Alcohol has killed money. millions. <laughs> <laughs> Is it millions? Right. Yeah, Hundreds of millions. thousands at least. Yeah. Right. Has, alcohol's been around long enough to definitely have killed millions. It's yeah. addictive. It makes people aggressive. And it's more, yeah, it's very much addictive yes. and torn families apart. Exactly. Yeah. I always hated how, like, some shows portray weed, though, because it always makes it seem like, damn, bro, I'm going to smoke and I'm going to be fucking <clears throat> happy and shit. And <laughs> I, <laughs> really, it just amplifies the current mood you're in. So yeah. if you're not feeling great, sometimes mm -hmm. weed will just make you make that worse. Yeah. But for Granddad, I think this is exactly what he needed. Yeah. Because he's always yeah. stressed out all the time and it just finally calmed his mind down. There's yeah. a lot like I mean, that. Sorry. It also depends on like the kind of weed. Mm -hmm. And I know yeah. there's studies came out recently that like the weed now is so much stronger. Yeah. And yeah. just like the, the way it's, it's been. Now. What's the process called? Ooh, hybrid, evolved. like just growing yeah, cultivation. Yeah, like the way it's been just changed. Cross breeding. Uh, cr yeah, mm -hmm. it just it it just enhances the you know the the psychedelic Psycho effects. Yeah. And represses the like the relax the more relaxing. So I like the hippie. Whereas yeah. like I that's what I want. I want like the chill. Mm -hmm. You gotta you gotta do like a low t you gotta do like a THC CBD balance. Yep. Yeah, that's yeah. What I that, that, that yeah. sometimes makes you sleepy too. But then there's there's Delta Eight, which removes some of the psychoactive components. Yeah. But I mean, people yeah. people call that diet weed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's, but it's not worth the flower ain't worth yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. I think it depends maybe the on the person. On the it's a, yeah, I do agree that they need to make some. I think last time I we like brought some stuff home, mm -hmm. I did actively make a choice to get some pre-rolls that were like very low in THC yeah. for like my neighbors and friends that don't often smoke, but they mm -hmm. want to. Because mm -hmm. like, it sucks when you're like, people that don't smoke, they, they've smoked in the past, like 10 years ago, like, yeah, I'll, okay. I'll hit that. And it's fucking like, yeah. it's way too intense. Any, yeah. Anytime I'm in a weed legal state now, like I, I used to go to the dispensary and just like shop for myself based on just like the That's names. Mm -hmm. But... I, I don't do that anymore. I just I go up to the bud tender and I'm just like, just give me your just chill. Just yeah. something, <laughs> something I want to relax. Yeah. Yeah. Something that's not going to be anxious, yeah. paranoid. And they're like, yeah, 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 we, yeah. Yeah. we have yeah. two yeah. strains, Mickey and Cash. Yeah. 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 Mickey and Cash. Yeah. Right there. There's Kaya and Shiva. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think that's Number, a yeah. good thing about like states that do have a legal, like the bud tenders are actually like knowledgeable yeah. that you can talk to them. Like, this yeah. is what issue at like in Nevada I was like yeah they will like tell you like this is all that like, you need they had a full on chart like you could like look at through the chart like this is what made more like yes. extensive but sometimes even it. those bud tenders like they're smoking every day too they are and so like the advice they're giving out is like 
It's like, yeah, I'll take like one of these and I'll feel fine, you know? Mm. Yeah, then no, you switch it. Like, 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 then then yeah. you switch it because like some of them are actually like some dispensary that do go through the training mm-hmm. they, where they actually sit down and like to talk to you. Yeah. Like, yeah, the like, best ones are in, va- in, ones. in Nevada and Colorado bartenders yeah. I've experienced personally. But yeah. number one, sir just farted next to me. And number two, oh, number two, I did not. Uh, there's be- the, the thing about <laughs> weed too. Like, <laughs> there's different ways to smoke and in- ingest it. Now you don't necessarily have to smoke it. You know, you can mm-hmm. get edibles. Yeah. There's CBD creams. There's yeah. whatever. There's like so many different versions now, and it's That's the better. Awesome. They had one. In, you don't have to do like drinking or smoke weed or format. anything to have fun. But inhaler like, you have to choose one yeah. weed. It was like and, literally a weed inhaler. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah. for yeah. Grandpa, it worked. It lowered his stress level, which mm-hmm. actually does like the stress can cause a lot of issues in your body mm-hmm. that's not necessarily can be solved by medicine. Yeah. Um, but what he needed was, because he was old, he just needed to get medicinal marijuana so he could have been just mm-hmm. easier. Mm-hmm. I think he could have just, any Should of it, it, he could have gotten it. But they were going to move to Cali. But I guess they are not, it's not legal in the state they are. Which Should I every state, state have at least like medical, at least some medical every state? If, if Granddad waited like three years, it would have, like th- that's when it started really sweeping the nation with the medicinal legalization yeah. and everything. But yeah. like, there's so many, Patience is everything. I'm guessing yeah. 2010 it's still, or 09. Not every state has everything I think legal. Every state is stupid. different. I it think also, in Indiana, uh, medicinal is no. legal. Is it, no, it's, no. Not. In it's, not. it's decriminalized they have, now. It's have decriminalized. Like they also have THC okay. in pill format now. Yeah. But I, I love that the Skywalker weed that he had <laughs> it was actually making him walk Sucks. in the sky it's like this is That's hilarious. hilarious yeah and it was Mark Hamill's voice actor on top like it was all yeah. just a perfect little circle and Ron and you're like it's Skywalker it's perfect because he's the voice actor. <laughs> <laughs> it was awesome I did not expect to see this and the judge was great the, the judge, judge was like I forget whose voice that is but he sounds I think familiar it too. might be Robert Paulson it was like a, his, that name was Robert his name Paulson. was Robert Paulson he was perfect. He was like very reasonable. It's like okay, cool. I uh, always wanted Craig's dad from Friday to smoke weed. So yeah, I'm glad we're gonna see like what John Witherspoon would have actually maybe been like smoking weed. You know what I mean, because that character never smokes in any no. of those three movies. No. One last thing I want to say though, like weed can be laced. Be careful. Like if there's a dispensary near you, go do that. I mean, I like support your local drug dealers. I guess I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know but advice. like, if there's a dispensary, like you just know that it's safe there, and like you know you're like not gonna get laced with anything. It's just guaranteed. Yeah. It's crazy yeah. how, how much like it costs though, and how much it's taxed. Man, yeah. not Denver, not in Colorado, um, Denver. Den- hey, oh, man. Denver was able it's to pay for the whole taxed. like entire school system. Oh, bro, it's that. way cheaper. Even with the tax, it's way cheaper in the dispensaries if you yeah. go to the right one. Like the one yeah. I the one I go to in Michigan, bro, they have sixty dollar ounce. But then, like the taxes, but now, but the taxes now, are oh, some good shit. Michigan, but like, now, big cannabis is putting putting out our small time dealers. Or big I want to call out Illinois. <laughs> True. The state of Illinois, you for... suck. The state of Illinois, you you the, the taxes are stupid and the Damn. prices are stupid. Hey, at okay. least the money yeah, there is are some not. States where it's like, at least the money is still in rotation mm, and not going underground. Yeah. And yeah. I think in the end of a day, it's better to. It sucks that who has dispensaries, but it's safer to go through dispensary than your like no. your local. If For you sure. don't know yeah. who your dealer is, it's more is. controlled. You know, not the amount. safe. I, I just think not it's wild. Safer, but you just know what you're getting. Just you know yeah. what you're getting. Like, yeah, it's wild that other states. It's wild that everyone hasn't legalized it just by seeing the sheer amount that was made from taxes right like, on it. Like you can fix mm-hmm. so many problems in your city. We'd have less mm-hmm. potholes. Fuck, right? less oh, potholes. I yes. swear to God, they use the expensive pothole stuff in like the north and Carmel and stuff, and then downtown they're like. Where's the cheap stuff? Like every year we need maybe, a new pothole. Maybe teachers wouldn't have to have two other jobs yeah. to survive. Ooh. That being said, tomorrow it will have been one year since I've smoked weed. Damn. We should celebrate with some weed. People yeah, who are should. watching us didn't know. <laughs> there you go. We should celebrate with weed. But going from Who's watching how much I was well. using, it's I don't a know. Lot. Maybe there's new people who just joined us. And have are you no done, done forever now? No, nah, but I think I'm done smoking it. I think I am going to ingest it in different ways. Though. Oh, bro, they got these new butt plugs and they come with <laughs> weed lube already on it, right? Why do you know so, that? Yeah, you you love it. You love it. You love it. All right, it's going gonna, it's gonna to really relax you. The only downside is that your butthole so relaxed the butt plug Did you say butt plug? Are you not going to have the butt rectal implosion? Imagine weed lube, like, or, or even yeah, like if, if you like jerk off and you get high while you're jerking off. Right? Is this a joke or is this real? Yeah. Dude, weed be. lube would be sick. Because butt plugs does so, have a good ring to it. Weed lube would make your dick limp. Yeah, would you? Would it? Yeah. What? Yeah, make your dick limp. 
Why would oh. it do that? It prevents the rectal implosion. Because there's a blood. There won't be any buffalo because you take the blood away. Stop it. dick is going to be way too Implosion. What? Your dick is going to be too high. Like, you know how you get whiskey what? dick? It doesn't you, work you like a bag. <laughs> nah, I don't think that's... You, you sure? I don't think that's how it and works. And with that, because <laughs> I don't want to know what happens to people's erections. We're going go. to go... Okay, no, real quick. Oh, you want to you might need to go to the THC. doctor, my guy. I love tea, THC. It's actually really good. Are you giving people weed yeah, advice? Yeah, can we please not give advice? Yeah, we don't don't that. That. No, this is our personal anecdotes. We don't condone this shit. This is our personal stories. This is personal. I mean, like, weed is legal in a lot of places now. It's our personal stories. It's our personal anecdotes. It's our personal anecdotes. We don't condone this. Don't do drugs. I, yes, I, and, don't. and if you're under the age of 24, do not be doing it on the daily, in my opinion. Yeah. Wait for that brain to develop a little bit more. 100%. And be careful with drinking, too, because mm-hmm. drinking, while legal, is really dangerous. Yeah. Stay sober. Do yeah. heroin. Stay sober. <laughs> <laughs> Cut that out. Um, <laughs> Lord. Bye. 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 <laughs> Hey, what's up, you bunch of Uncle Ruckuses? Thank you for watching another episode of Boondocks with us. A big shout out to Film It Rick, Joe Mags, Puppy, Anthony Hardy, Lucas, and Martin Dagswald. We'll see you on the next reaction.